Signore e signore, benvenuti in questo nuovo video. Io sono Zero e oggi continueremo Dying Light 2. Siamo arrivati al quinto episodio. Nello scorso episodio ci hanno beccato i pacificatori mentre stavamo cercando di aprire il tunnel per arrivare al fisheye e ora in questo episodio andremo a scoprire che cosa ci faranno io vi ricordo subito di lasciare un mi piace al video e vi ricordo soprattutto che oggi usciranno due video l'altro uscirà alle 15 ed è una puntata speciale su PUBG quindi non perdetevelo per nessun motivo al mondo anche perché è molto molto speciale detto questo andiamo in game Where did he come from? He was wandering through the tunnels fucking bizarre riff raff More like a renegade spy hmm. Doesn't look like a renegade He's awake. What were you doing at our base? I'm only trying to get to the city center. The center? <laughs> the tunnel's gonna be closed until you hand over Lucas's killers. Bizarre scum. How is it that you lot saw nothing, heard nothing, and you managed to forget about the ban on passage? Maybe we'll start punishing you by cutting off your hands. That would improve your memory, huh? What were you doing four days ago? I'm a pilgrim. Four days ago, I was a hundred kilometers away. Enough, Anderson. We need the truth, and you won't get it through coercion. But Commander Lucas, Lucas always is said... dead, and now I'm in command. You've read the reports. A pilgrim appeared in the bazaar yesterday. It looks like he's not lying. Leave us, Sergeant. I want to talk to him alone. Where did you come from? From Crossdale River. That's over 1,500 kilometers from here. It's actually more than 2,000. The freeway bridge has collapsed. There are no straight paths. And you've managed to make it so far away. Impressive. What's it like out there these days? When was the last time you were out of the city? About 15 years ago. And then there were that many fewer survivors. And that many more infected. Stands to reason. Most people endure living in this hellhole because what's out there has got to be so much worse. My wife and I lived in England. I had two sisters, two brothers. I haven't heard from them for 10 years. Where did they live? In and around London. From what I've been told, London doesn't exist. There may be four settlements left on the entire island. Fucking hell. Why would anyone think I killed your commander? You tried to escape to the Central Loop four days after the murder. Besides, if I were Carl, I'd hire a stranger to kill Lucas too. It's the cleanest way. Well... I don't know who Carl is. Oh, you'll find out soon enough. Carl keeps both hands on the steering wheel. He's a faux sanctimonious prick who's turning the entire bazaar against us, even though we protect them. What's it like outside the walls? You never know where danger's gonna come from. Always new territories, new threats. And you came here to take shelter. I came here because I'm looking for someone. And a lot of people are said to have survived in Villador. You're looking for someone. Hmm, maybe I can help you, but not for free. I'm used to trading. What do you need? No nonsense. That's good. The tunnel will be closed until I find our commander's murderer, Commander Lucas. His body was found in the bazaar, horribly mutilated. The people of the bazaar aren't making this easy. They're proud and loyal. They refuse to turn anyone in. But Command has lost its patience. I have orders from the top, Pilgrim. If the inhabitants of Old Vilador continue to revolt, our army will come here and burn the bazaar to the ground. 
Now I'd rather avoid that. And what do you need from me? Lucas had a weapon. A rare set of brass knuckles called the Lazarus. This is the key to finding the killer. If you learn anything about the Lazarus, tell me, and I will most certainly return the favor. It's worth a lot, and we didn't find it on his body. I think someone from the bazaar may have appropriated it. And why should I work with you? You attacked me and accused me of murder with no proof whatsoever. Our mistake. You're clearly not the murderer. Why can't you investigate on your own? I hardly know anyone here. That's exactly why you can help me. Nobody will talk to us. To them, we're occupiers. The fact that we clear the streets of the infected and catch criminals, doesn't matter. What matters is that we eat their food and drink their water. But you, you're a pilgrim. There are many ways you can help people. And you're from the outside. They can trust you. They tried to kill me. Nah, look. We are your only chance. If you want to get to the center, that is. So, will you help me? Ok, quindi qua siamo già davanti a una scelta. Possiamo provarci oppure ho le mie cose da sbrigare. Se lui ha detto che ci può aiutare a raggiungere il tunnel, cioè a raggiungere il centro sbloccandoci il tunnel, perché, perché no? Proviamoci. So if I find that weapon, you'll let me through to the center? It's not that easy. Vilador suffered much. First it was isolated from the outside world because of infection. Then the walls became its salvation. But people here learned not to trust easily. I won't open the passage until I've caught the killer. But if you can find the Lazarus, I'll remember that. You'll be the first one through once justice is done. Sounds as if I have no other choice. I'll try. Look around. Ask people. And don't come back empty-handed. Good luck. Ok, quindi non ci hanno torturato ma ci hanno offerto un, uh, un patto per ottenere diciamo una, una vittoria sia noi che loro Vogliono che gli aiutiamo a trovare l'assassino di Lucas, il loro capo, il loro comandante E come prova dobbiamo portargli il coltello di Lucas che si chiama Lazzaro Ah, ecco non trovi Usciamo You must help us. Otherwise there will be a rebellion. Allora, usciamo e andiamo a trovare Akon lassù. Sempre sotto gli zombie. Guarda, per riscaldarmi ne ammazzo due. Aia, fa culo. Vieni qua. Come riscaldamento proprio. Allora, saliamo e andiamo da Akon. Come on. Tell me all about. So, what did they want from you? If you've been there like you said you'd be, I'm... Oh, oh, I did my best. I didn't know there was anyone else in the tunnel. Lucas's death is a big deal. They love this motherfucker like a father. Ato doesn't have Lucas's charisma. He's gonna have problems. Ato said he might let me through to the center. If I help him. What? What are you supposed to help him with? He wants me to find Lucas's weapon. The Lazarus. Went missing from the crime scene. And he believes finding it will help find the killer. The Lazarus, huh? Fancy set of brass knuckles, right? I know a guy who trades stolen goods and other shit he gets from thieves. A fence? Part-time fence. Full-time scammer. An artless one, too. He's got half the city after him for death right now. If anyone in Villador is fool enough to buy a peacekeeper weapon, it would be him. And what's his name? Hubert Carbatos. Also known as Half-Ass Hubie. Every day he sets up shop in the nearby windmill and waits for customers. Probably selling booze and weed to the PKs. If you want to find the Lazarus, talk with Hubie. I'll chase down some other leads. Okay, let's keep in touch.
Ok, quindi dobbiamo andare a trovare questo Yubi che potrebbe avere questo tirapugni. Infatti non era un coltello, era un tirapugni. Allora, dove dobbiamo andare? Intanto vedo, già su qui c'è un sacco di cose in giro da poter prendere da, come missioni secondarie. Ma, come ho detto anche nell'episodio di ieri, fatemi sapere se volete vederle in live sull'altro sito le, le varie attività secondarie di questo gioco. E vi ricordo che oggi, in live, sempre sull'altro sito, iniziamo una nuova serie. Oggi sarà una giornata molto piena, ci saranno due video. E due live Perché alle 18 saremo live Su Lost Ark Che oggi è il day one E alle 21 saremo live su Tanto qua cado Saremo live su Sifu Un altro day one Passa dei live se sono le 18 o le 21 Tanto ho raccolto Ascia. Aia aia Ma sono mani loro Ma stavo dicendo una cosa Un attimino Allora Vieni qua Aia, devo curare Ah no, no, cura di noi il fungo Aspetta, aspetta, vieni qua No, ma gli ho fatto la parata perfetta Aia Non riesco a fargli la parata perfetta Vieni qua Ma c'è gli zombie dietro, stupido Ah, è tutto un piano da dietro? No Uno è morto Ok Mannaggia Mancavano solo i banditi Ok Ci sono tutti Con una macchina da guerra cavolo Allora cerchiamo Vediamo che hanno Andiamo a prenderci il nostro Ottino Dobbiamo scassinarlo prima Allora E così No No ma porca miseria Ok Che mi dai di bello Guanti da ranger E riso Va bene Allora andiamo lì Andiamo da Ubi Dobbiamo salire là sopra Come saliamo? Da quel tubo Ce la fa con eh, il vigore? Sì dovrebbe Dai 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 Non mollare No sali Niente E una pappa molla oh. Ok penso di averlo trovato Uh, ci salgo lì Facciamo così Andiamo a rincorsa Ottimo Saliamo Lo salire sopra? Eh mi sa di sì Che cosa? Un ascensore Eh cazzo l'ho pancato tantissimo Tipo l'ascensore questo Oppala Aspettiamo che sale Salve. You Hubert? No, not me. I'm waiting for Hubie too. So get in line. Got it. You know when he'll be here? Maybe in an hour. Maybe two. You never know with old half assed That said, he's got the best moonshine. So, worth the wait. Eh, nothing to do but wait, I guess. Hey, you Hubert? Who's asking? A customer. I want to buy something. Hey, you're that stranger they wanted to hang, aren't you? Hey, Hubie, you got a special customer. It's that pilgrim from the bazaar. W wait, I just want to buy something. So, that was Hubie, wasn't it? Yep. Apparently had an urgent appointment with another customer. Ma questo poi yeah, dove è sure. spuntato? Vabbè, dobbiamo inseguire Coso, mi sa. Anche un inseguimento vero e proprio. Via, 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 via. E ora guarda come lo perdo. E sto andando. Eh. 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 Olè. Io ho tutta la stamina, perfetto. Ma come lo prendo in 50 secondi? Aia Ah non ora, non ora Non rompere le palle Aia Ma non adesso Ma stai zitto Sì 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 Sali Perfetto Ciao Ma 
mamma mia, il parkour è una cosa che se non ci fai l'abitudine subito prendi le mazzate. Dove sta? No, sono caduto. Ho sbagliato. Aspetta che mi curo. Vai, saliamo da qua. Aspetta, salgo qui. Alta. Come l'hai perso? Ce l'ho io, ce l'ho io. No, dai, non ci arriva. Ma dai. Donna Aiden, sei veramente però... La mammoletta. Come cazzo hai fatto il pellegrino? Non, non sai scavalcare una parete. Una. Io come salgo? Eh, vabbè, però, quest'altro. Veramente, veramente eh, imbarazzante, eh, Aiden. Io te lo dico. Veramente imbarazzante. Da dove cacchio salto? Da là. Proprio da là. Allora. Fermo. Veramente, veramente imbarazzante, Aiden. Le brutte figure che mi stai facendo fare. Oh, sali. No, è arrivato, brutto idiota. Ma io non ci voglio credere, dai, non ci voglio credere. Su. Dai, dai, ci sei. Perfetto. Salve. Non mi hurt me. Non so niente. About what? I haven't asked you anything yet. I don't know anything about anything, I swear. I'm told that you're a fence, hm? A fence? No way. A reseller, maybe, but. I'm looking for the Lazarus. Yeah, I used to belong to Lucas, the late PK commander. And don't try to tell me you don't know who Lucas is. Well, then I won't. You know anything about the Lazarus? Are you kidding me? Even if I'd been offered those brass knuckles, I would have refused. I'm not an idiot. That weapon is way too hot. Why did you run away from me? Because every five minutes someone's coming after me, man. Okay, I may have given people a reason to be mad, but I'll make things right. Soon. Eventually. Maybe. How did you know the Lazarus is a set of brass knuckles, hmm? I didn't say that. Come on. Everyone knew about Lucas's little love glove. He was always showing it off. If anyone thought I had him, they might also think I killed Lucas, which is bullshit. Yeah, but someone tried to sell it to you, right? I told you, I... Okay, fine. Maybe someone did, but I can't say who. Client confidentiality. Stop fucking around. Tell me or I... Her name is Maya. I met her in the tenement building at Meatpacking Square, near the old butcher shop. But I don't know anything else. Leave me alone. It overlooks some army barracks or some shit. All right, I can find that. Ok, dobbiamo andare hey, da Maya. Hubert said someone tried to sell him the Lazarus. Do you know a Maya? No. Strange, because I thought I knew all the women here. I'm headed to Meatpacking Square. Anche meno. Meatpacking Square. It's a fucked up place. There are some barracks there the army set up in 23 when shit went south. She's supposed to be in one of the buildings that overlook them. Okay. Stay in touch, bro. Hey, bro. Devo andare, obiettivo raggiunto, obiettivo aggiornato. Vediamo dov'è. Allora, dobbiamo andare lì, 240 metri. Come scendo senza morire? Oddio, là sopra, dire che ce la faccio? Non penso. Oh, lì, 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 perfetto. Lì dovrei. Eh. Perfetto. Allora, scendiamo e andiamo lì. Allora, allora, dobbiamo incontrare questa maglia che ha provato a vendere il tirapugni a Yubi. Cerchiamo di non combattere troppo perché stanno cominciando a scarseggiare le medicine. E vorrei evitare di non averne quando mi servono. Perfetto, sali, sali veloce. Onna, sto vigore dura un secondo, Aiden. Ripeto, è meno male che sei un pellegrino. Ok. Eh, il buio. Evviva. Sento tanti rumori. Oddio. Oddio. Chi è? Chi è?
Però c'è un qualcosa... Oh, è sotto. Ok, apri. Sempre facendo tutto il rumore possibile, ovviamente. Sta facendo anche buio. Vedo che c'è una cosa a 7 metri. 9, si allontana. 4 metri, 3 metri. Porco cane! Che cazzo ci fai tu qua? Sei pazzo. Forse è sopra. Forse è sopra. Vabbè, poi vedrò. Probabilmente è sopra. Vedo della luce UV. Ah, è su. Oh, eccolo. Ok, ne abbiamo uno in più. Abbiamo uno o due? Quanti ne abbiamo presi? Oh, abbiamo un potenziamento. Allora, io mi potenzierei un altro po' il vigore, ragazzi, perché veramente dura pochissimo ogni volta. E ho visto che mi ha sbloccato delle abilità per il parkour, ok? Quindi se sblocchiamo la vita, cioè se portiamo avanti la vita, ci sblocca delle, delle abilità del, del combattimento, a quanto ho capito, parkour invece col vigore, perfetto. Però allora, manteniamoci un po' sul vigore perché è fondamentale. Ok, qua. Ninna nana. Hey kids, I'm um, I'm looking for a woman named Maya. <laughs> it was so funny. Maya ain't a grown-up. She's just a plain old girl. Hold on. You were the one trying to sell a PK weapon to Hubert? Yeah, but the jerk didn't want it. He got all freaked out and chased me away. How did you get a hold of a peacekeeper weapon? We all found it. Was wandering around with these punks and ran across a corpse. Happens a lot. He was totally dead. We searched him. And I took the brass who's a Watsits because I figured someone would pay a pretty penny for him. Maya, I need that weapon. It's very important. Do you expect me to just hand that brass who's a Watsit over? Are you nuts? The who's a Watsits real name is the Lazarus, and it belonged to an important PK. We might have a war if I don't return it. You could help us find a murderer. Okay. I'll give you the stupid thing. But for 500. Eh, io tratterei, ragazzi. Bo, oh, trattiamo, dai. That's a lot of money, kid. Of course it is. Life's damn expensive. I have to buy water and a marker for my brother. He's turning 12 soon, you know. I can give you 10, and that's my last offer. Deal. Nobody wanted to buy it anyway. Ok, abbiamo pagato 10, dai, ci sta, senza troppi problemi. Allora, dobbiamo uscire, dobbiamo andare ai pacificatori. Ok. Ok. Allora, brighiamoci che si sa per fare notte, eh. Sono le 7 meno un quarto. L'obiettivo è di là. Corriamo, corriamo, corriamo. Vattene a fa culo. Cosa c'è? Chi apre? Ok, questo si apre con la chiave. No, ma è bloccato. Oh no, si è aperto, ok. Scusi, signorina. C'è una, una cassa da scassinare. Ok. Fatto. Pure viola la cassa. Che altro qui? Ok, c'è kit di pronto soccorso militare. Formula immunità. Martello d'epoca? Buono. Era 24. Che altro? Allora, aspetta. Fammi vedere questo inventario. Togliamo questa. Abbiamo questa che è il 24 e poi ne abbiamo una che è il 27. Eh, infatti quella qui è più forte della nostra. Questa è a due mani, però. Carina, proviamo, proviamo adesso qua a due mani. Allora. Ok. Va bene. Approvata. Ci siamo, ci siamo, ci siamo. Ok. Siamo arrivati. Apri. Chiudi. Ok, siamo arrivati, siamo arrivati, meno male. 
Salve, spengo la luce. Salve. Ah, oh, the pilgrim has returned. I hope not empty-handed. I found the Lazarus. I'll be damned. I was right that you could open doors we couldn't. Where's the fucker who had him? In Meatpacking Square. You didn't let him go, did you? That could have been the murderer. A, a girl had him. She's ten or something. She didn't kill him. Just looted the corpse. Stop. We'll get back to this later. Leave us. Ah, it looks like a constellation on your arm. Those are rank tattoos. When we ran low on resources, tattoos eventually replaced medals. They show our hierarchy. Like in prison? Prison or military, it's all the same. There's always a pecking order. I did what you wanted. It's your turn. Get me to the center. Opening the tunnel to the central loop is beyond my pay grade, Pilgrim. Command wants me to find the killer. Ader, you promised! Cool down, Pilgrim. I keep my promises. First, take this. Token of gratitude. Ader, I have to get to the center. Get it? You're looking for someone, right? I want to go to the central loop, too. My wife and kids are there. And I can't protect them when I'm stuck here. The tunnel will open when I find the killer. Is that clear? You can help me, or you can wait until I find him myself. I see traces of blood on the Lazarus's blades. Lucas managed to wound his killer before he died. Oh, bastard's got to have a nasty gash. If you find him, you'll not only help me, you'll be helping yourself. <sighs> okay. Do you have any suspects? The commander was murdered in the bazaar. There had to be someone from there. The people of the bazaar are simple folk. Why would they risk defying you? And that's why I want to discover the truth before the orders come down to use force. Besides, appearances can be deceiving. They want to get rid of us. They think anarchy is the key to building a new world. Well, there is plenty of anarchy these days. Carl is a faux pious hustler who brainwashes others with slick speeches. He says everyone's equal, but it's bullshit. You can't be a leader and an equal at the same time. I'll try to find Lucas's killer. Splendid. That's your ticket to the center. Head back to the bazaar. Is there anything else I should know before I go? Yes, as a matter of fact. But this is totally hush-hush. Word of this cannot get out. Sounds serious. Whoever killed Lucas took a little trophy. Carved his tattoo right out of his bloody arm. They cut into his corpse? That is seriously fucked up. Yeah, seriously. Men found out Lucas was desecrated like that, they'd lose their shit. And it would be total war. I'm telling you this, because if you find that little... trophy... Then you found the sick fuck who killed Lucas. Got it. I'll head out right now. Wow. Quindi dobbiamo tornare al bazar. Dobbiamo tornare al bazar e trovare qualcuno con una ferita. Aiden. Still alive? You're worried about eh. me, are you? Per ora. Of course. I have high hopes for you, Aiden. Ma di qua Meet me outside. Sempre incontrami di fuori. Comunque puoi trovare un, una persona con una grande cicatrice perché è stato colpito. E poi si è portato come trofeo il tatuaggio di Lucas. Quindi trovare quello che vale a trovare l'assassino. Peter wants me to find Lucas's murderer. Only then will he help me get to the center. Not doing his dirty work. Well, that's no surprise. He told me to start with the bazaar. Figures. PK and the bazaar really hate each other. Only two people matter at the bazaar. One is that overblown preacher, Carl. I know that. Who else is there? Sophie, his right hand. She has a way with the bazaar's more rebellious souls. Helps him keep control. There's also Dodger, a local gangster. He knows what's going on, and about the bandits led by Joe. But they're afraid of the PK. Okay, I'll talk to Sophie and you look into Carl, unless... you prefer the girl. 
Sophie. No, she's not really my type, you know? And headstrong. She's... you'll see. Va bene, quindi dobbiamo parlare con Sophie al bazar. Eh, sperando di, che non sia troppo lontano. Dovrebbe essere troppo lontano. Usciamo da qui. Forse uscire di notte non è proprio il massimo, però non mi va di aspettare. Là c'è uno strillone, quindi passiamo da qui. Sono quanti metri? 260. Vabbè, li fanno easy. Ok, siamo quasi arrivati, dai. Là c'è uno strillone, quindi passiamo di qui. Ok, ci siamo. Però non posso scendere così. Eh, devo scendere per forza da qua, mi sa. Valca. Permesso. Scusi. Scusi, devo passare però. Vabbè, vaffanculo. Guarda che non mi fa passare quello lì. Ok. Devo entrare in forza da qua. Hey, who the fuck are you? Easy, chief. He ain't PK. How do you know? They're creeping around here all the time. He's that outsider, the pilgrim. What? He's from outside the walls. Well, fuck me. I don't know what brings you here, but watch your back, Pilgrim. And stay away from the PKs. They ain't no one's friends. This time with a biomarker. Carl said if you show up to bring your round so he can introduce himself. What a nice change from wanting to hang me. Humanity created a civilization that turned out to be a colossus on clay legs. We cannot make the same mistakes. He didn't want to, he had to. You were a threat to everyone. Of course. Do not listen to the ideologies preached by fools calling for reconstruction. There will be no rebuilding. Who would have thought? A pilgrim in the bazaar. Welcome. Yeah, I'm still alive, despite your best efforts. It's clear to me you're holding a grudge. But if you were in my shoes, you would understand. We are responsible for the safety of our community. And we treat this seriously. That's why we did what we did. I hope you can forgive us. So, pray tell. What's it like in the outside world these days? bad and getting worse settlements are shrinking in size and number i'm afraid soon there will be nowhere else to go doesn't surprise me son humanity must reach the bottom in order to rise again and this is why we are here any more news not really but uh why don't you tell me more about your people we are called the people of the bazaar simply because of where we live But who we are truly are free people. Free from lies, free from money, free from religion, wars, politics, and the dark cloud that has blanketed the earth. That sounds great. Too good to be true, in fact. Oh, we have our challenges. Water is scarce, for example. But with courage and patience, we will someday create a paradise. Well, you seem almost thankful for the collapse of civilization. It was as tragic as it was inevitable. Consumerism, belief in the almighty dollar led to this catastrophe. So, we here strive not to make the same mistake twice. It would be a crime. We want to create a new order based on social bonds, on family and community. A society where people support each other and adhere to justice. No need for the police, military, or false authorities to shoot those they are meant to protect. We have a place for everyone. But let's get back to your stories. Is gossip all you want from me, Carl? No. But you came from outside, and you're walking around my flock. So, to set things straight, I need to know if you're a sheep or a wolf. What are you then? Ok, siamo una pecora, non corri i pericoli. Siamo un lupo, fai attenzione. Uh, non corro pericoli, non è vero. Eh, faccio attenzione, non è vero, quindi non mi piace come metafora. Yeah, I'm not really fan of this metaphor. Ah, yes. 
I see. Pilgrims are not people of metaphors or poetry. They prefer to act. Yeah, about acting. I'm looking for Sophie. Are you? And why, pray tell? Allora, sentiamo quello che cerco. Cerchiamo Ho un pacco per lei. No, devo chiedere la morte di Lucas. No, troppo diretto. Sono affari miei. That's my business. Not when you're on my turf, pilgrim. But fine. I'll humor you. Your business, whatever it may be, is not a threat to us. After all, you're just one man. And we are many. Go that way. You'll see a giant of a man. That's Herman, Sophie's bodyguard. She won't be far. And I really hope your business doesn't make Herman angry. Farewell, my friend. Quindi Sophie è la guardia del corpo di Carl e a sua volta una guardia del corpo. Molto bene. Salve. Se vuoi? Sophie, can we talk? Don't hurt him, Herman. Let him talk. My name's Aiden. You're that pilgrim that came to town recently. You're sure well informed. Don't have much of a choice. I'm in charge of safety here. Besides, yesterday you made quite an entrance. I'm looking for a job. Would you happen to know of any? Looking for a job? I only work with people I trust. You came from outside. They wanted to hang you. Nobody says anything good about you, pilgrim. Do you want me to trust you? Talk to the people at the bazaar. See if you can gain their trust. If so, then it might persuade me to change my mind. Di nuovo questa cosa di parlare con quelli del bazar, ma basta. Però ho cosa da fare? Ma come? Ma l'ho già l'ho fatta. Altra missione? Yeah, you. Yeah, you. Eh, dimmi. I'm Damien. Aiden. You're new here, right? Does it make a difference? I pride myself on knowing everyone in this dump, but I don't know you. Maybe that's because I just got into the city. For reals? Wow. Respect. I heard that outside the walls, it's a bloodbath. What does this have to do with the job? Nothing, my friend. Just sussing you out. And I like what I've sussed so far. But about the job, first and foremost, it'll require a certain amount of discretion on your part. You'll be doing business for my partners, and it's their business only. No one else's. Head on over to meet them in West Quarriand. They'll fill you in on the details. Understood. I'll go report to them. <laughs> Don't keep them waiting. Ok, andiamo a fare questa missione così vediamo se ci prendiamo ci guadagniamo la fiducia di Sophie. Sono le 22:41, dobbiamo andare quanto lontano? No, qua vicino, dai. Sai che devo salire. That's Aiden. I've just been offered an extremely shady deal. Maybe it'll turn up a lead on Lucas. I need more than just leads, Aiden. Azzo. We'll do. Over and out. Cazzo Eh, salve Scusi un attimo Posso stare qui? Ok Scusate Sono entrato in casa a quelli Qua dentro Hello? Anybody there? Damien sent me Hello? What do you want? Damien sent me He said you have work here Wrong address, bud. But I just talked to him. Damien, he sent me here. You alone? Why do you ask? Because we're not letting in tour groups. Nothing personal. It's just, you know, we're careful people. So I'll ask again. Are you alone? Yeah, I'm alone. You'd better be. Now get in and head downstairs, they'll explain everything. Are you interested or not? Salve. Ottima accoglienza, devo dire. Eh? Scendiamo le scale, perfetto. Salve, mi hanno mandato da sopra. I'm Aiden. 
Damien sent me. I'm uh, here for the job. Right. So, you're new around here. Damien asked that too. What difference does it make? Boss asked a question. Now, I'm still trying to figure out why I'm here. Yeah, you're the one dancing around the subject. Okay. Let's talk about the job then. To do it, it's best that you're not all that well known around the bazaar. Well, I wouldn't say I'm all that well known. That's good. That's very good. Looks like we finally found our missing person. Wait, what are you talking about? What do you want from me? Let's just say we work for someone that's dying to meet you. Except he won't be the one dying, I don't think. Call him in, boys. <laughs> Pezzi di merda Spacco tutti Colpi di martello Anzi è che ti dico Vieni qua A due mani Mi taglio la testa A ah, fanculo eh? Aia Vieni qua A mani di testa Taglio a metà Bastardo Aspetta che mi curo eh a un momento Sì, via Mannaggia, non ho capito ancora queste parate di merda Ok E ora che gli dico a questi qua io? Ah, sono proprio morti tutti, perfetto Hey, you You How did you die? God, you asshole You set me up What? No, no, no. I, I swear, I, I would never. I, I was just doing my job. Scouting. It's my job. Who are these people? And why were they looking for me? I don't know, Aiden. You gotta believe me. Please! They just told me to send them anyone who seemed new. They didn't tell me why. I don't have any other choice but to do as they say. They have anything to do with Lucas's death. What? No. I mean... God, I... I hope not. That would be... Terrible. But I swear, I don't know. So you've sent others before me, and, and then they've all been murdered? God, what have you done, Damien? I didn't know. At first. But I couldn't do anything about it once I found out. I couldn't! How many, Damien? How many people have you sent to their death? Stop it, Aiden, stop! I'm sorry! I had to! I'm trapped! Believe me! They have my brother! Eh, che facciamo? Coperiamo? Che hanno suo fratello, poverino, dai. Your brother? I talk fast. They took him and threatened to kill him if I didn't do what they said. I just figured if I did good, they'd eventually release him. I'm being played. And I'm tired of it. I just want my brother back. Will you help me find him? You sent me to the slaughter, and now I'm supposed to forget that and help you find your brother. You're mad. I get it. But look at it this way. He may have heard why they're looking for you. If he could tell you, wouldn't you want to find him? Uh, dai, la aiutiamo. <sighs> All right, fine then. But you better pray that he knows something. Ah, più che altro perché voglio capire se mh, questa cosa poi aiuta con Sophie. Perché lei comunque ha detto di trovare qualcuno da fare da qualcosa da fare al bazar e conquistare la fiducia di Sophie. Secondo me questa qui è una di quelle cose da fare al bazar e poi conquistare la, la fiducia. Quindi facciamo questo. Andiamo a cercare il fratello di Damien che è qui. Ah, è qua. He's not here. Allora, mannaggia. Quindi non è qui suo... Eh, porco cane. Non è qui suo fratello. Ok. E qua. Lasciala, lasciamo. Allora, parliamo con Damien e diciamogli che non c'è suo fratello qui. No signs of Cliff here. Damn it. You don't think they... He's not... He's not dead. Is he? Don't jump to conclusions. But where could they be keeping him? Damn it. This is all my fault. I'm such a fool. Sending people here? Yeah, that's on you. 
As for your brother, I'm not certain. Where did you last see him? We were in East Quarry and close to Devil's Bridge when they attacked us. They took him hostage and have been using me to carry out their orders ever since. I only did this to keep my brother alive, Aiden. I didn't know others would die when this started. What's Devil's Bridge? It's the name of this building. In the Middle Ages, they said devils haunted it. But then times changed and no one believed in those things anymore. Before the virus, it was a car repair shop. Now it's full of bandits. And I guess I'll search the area around Devil's Bridge. Aiden, you serious? You do that for me? Not a chance. I'm doing this so that no one else dies because of you. Per oggi ci fermiamo qui. Abbiamo aiutato Damian. Eh, io spero che questa missione ci aiuti con Sofia e non sia soltanto una missione secondaria, perché già l'episodio dura tanto, quindi non vorrei aver perso del tempo, ma la continueremo nel prossimo episodio. Vi ricordo che oggi uscirà un altro video alle 15, un gameplay su PUBG. Una, diciamo un estratto di una live abbastanza speciale spero vi possa piacere poi fatemelo sapere quindi rimanete sintonizzati sul canale vi ricordo di lasciare un mi piace se il video vi è piaciuto con di condividerlo di iscrivervi al canale se ancora non l'avete fatto di passare in descrizione dove trovate tutti i link ai miei social e all'altro sito dove mi trovate in live tutte le sere alle 21 fino a mezzanotte tranne nel weekend e oggi sempre 8 febbraio mi troverete in una doppia live alle 18 giocheremo a Lost Ark con l'apertura dei server europei quindi abbiamo la possibilità di giocarlo in anticipo visto che il day one sarà l'11 febbraio ma eh, potremmo giocarlo già oggi 8 febbraio e poi alle 9 inizieremo una nuova serie in live che è Sifu gioco che si basa tutto sul, sul Kung Fu, sulle arti marziali quindi sarà molto molto figo, vi aspetto in tanti perché secondo me è un gioco che vale tanto per ora è tutto, vi ricordo ci vediamo alle 15 sempre qui su YouTube Jinkai Masai!